today's collectible spot, we're having a look at the So Analog 10 Doe Super Panda Cubs 3 Cartridge Collectibles. Coming to us from the good folks over at Squid Kids Inc. You can def definitely check them out at www.squidkidsinc.com. When Spot first initially saw images of these, you know that Spot was jumping to get my hands on these. Now, Spot's picked up a couple of them, and I'm going to do reviews on all of them. But if you've grown up in the 80s like myself, and you've grown up with these kind of cartridges, then this is definitely something I can't wait to get reviewed. The packaging itself, aside from what will be inside, the packaging itself features the traditional black sleeve. We've been there, I'm sure, at, at all times. Uh, at some point, we've had the, the cartridges with their black sleeves. The cartridge at the top, the gray cartridge, on the side of the box, Squid Kids Inc. for Geeks by Geeks, and certainly on the back, designs by Hyperactive Monkey, Andrew Wilson, Kozik, Nate Mitchell, Andy Poon, Linda Panda, uh, Quellstone, Tom Pearson, Tracy Tubera, and others. Again, Spots picked up a couple of these, so this is the first one, but certainly not the last that I'm going to be having a look at of So Analog. I'm definitely very excited to, to get this opened up. I'm going to take a break, I'm going to get this opened up, and when we come back, we're going to get a better look at the Super Panda Cubs 3 cartridge. There's definitely more to come. Stay tuned. Upon getting it out of package, you'll get yourself the cartridge itself. And you'll also get a couple of limbs. Well, we'll show the limbs in a second, but let's first have a look at this amazing cartridge. Now, these are, I suppose, essentially categorized as vinyl pieces. Um, what, you can, what you are getting when you get these so analog is you're getting a standard cartridge, but then you're getting the, the, the sticker plate on the front featuring the, the game in hand. So in this case, we have Super Panda Cubs 3, come to us from uh, So Analog. You can even see, as small of the details that they've put into this, it even says, Official Squid Kids, Inc. Stamp of... What does it say? Stamp of Love. Nice. The biggest, most exciting Panda Brothers adventure yet. Yes, this is depicting the classic cartridge of Super Mario Brothers 3. I have a soft spot for Super Mario Brothers 3. In fact, when I saw the initial ad for Super Mario Brothers 3 and you're I don't know if you're old enough to remember it. The old classic one where the kid's yelling, Mario, 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 Mario. And then the camera pans back and you see that people of different colored t-shirts all end up forming the face of Mario. I got it for my birthday and I was super excited. So having this in hand really for me is nostalgicness. Um, not only are you getting a cartridge, well the cartridge itself is a little bit bigger than the original cartridge the original style of what the cartridge was. I also love the inclusion of, I assume these to be eyes down below, because they have, of course, different images of, of uh, different cartridge uh, cartridges available. But we got little eyes down below, very reminiscent of the old uh, mushrooms. With a little dot glistening in the corner there. The cartridge sits on an angle, so it's not a straight out, straight cartridge. On the back, it says, caution, do not sort, store in extreme temperatures. Pandas don't like that. Do not drown the panda. Do not clean with solvents. It will hurt the panda. And then, so analog down below. And it says, made by SKI Ski. On the underside, you'll see two peg holes. A peg hole on either side of the cartridge as well. This will be where these uh, limbs will come into place. So you're going to take a foot. And you're going to take, I don't think the feet are specific, although one looks like, you know what, let's do this, we'll do it this way. I'm going to peg the foot in. Just a little bit of pressure just to get those feet in. I figured I'd shoot the, I'd show you guys what it looked like without the feet and then without the feet and arms, and I'd show you afterwards how easy it is just to peg those into place. Just a little bit of pegging. 
The fact that they are pegged into place, I would imagine too, you can adjust the feet, kind of rotate them. Same idea with the hands. Thumbs in, I always have to remember thumbs in. Sometimes spot does thumbs out. That doesn't always work out. I do thumbs out and then I look back, very proud of the work that I've done and I realize, ah, spot, you're an idiot. You put thumbs out. Thumbs out don't work. But there you have it. The so analog cartridge. I love the hands. First of all, I like the fact that the hands and the feet are black. It doesn't, it doesn't deter, it doesn't take away from the image of the actual cartridge. It only adds to it because it gives the personality that the cartridge is the main body and then the limbs are just st uh, are secondary to that cartridge. It also then ties into the, the idea of the eyes where you feel like it's an actual character. I suppose to some extent, yes, the hands could move, as again, you're just pegging them really into a hole. Uh, same idea with the feet, uh, but they do stand. They stand really, really well. Now, Squid Kid, Kids Inc. have produced larger scale to what you're, well, what you're seeing here is the larger scale. They've also got smaller versions of these as well. Uh, these have just started popping up. The best place if you are looking to get these, and I, I would highly recommend if you are of my age bracket and this screams nostalgic for you, I would definitely say, I'm gonna provide all the links down below. Now I've seen these on you know other toy sites as well, but your best bet if you wanna order these uh, is to order them directly from Squid Kids Inc. And I'm gonna provide the website down below if you wanna check that out. But these are absolutely awesome. In fact, Spot's gonna go one better. I would say of the stuff that I have reviewed, and perhaps this is just my nostalgic 80s kid inside of me, letting out the sigh of ee! I would probably say that these are the coolest thing that I've reviewed this year. I would probably say the, these are probably gonna be Spot's pick for 2013 of the coolest collectibles. Now again, Spot's picked up a couple of these. Um, I picked up some of the larger ones and I've picked up some of the, the uh, blind boxes as well. So I'm going to definitely cover a lot of these, but uh, I am so incredibly happy. It might stem from the fact also that I got this for my birthday that I was really excited and this was the first one I wanted to do, but uh, I'm happy with how it turned out and I think Squid Kids Inc. did a fantastic job. I'm definitely looking forward to getting the rest reviewed for you guys. And if you are as big of a fan of the old classic cartridges that I am, as I am, I would definitely say order yours today. Today's collectible spot, we're having a look at the Super Panda Cubs 3 So Analog Cartridge Character. Oh, so awesome. So awesome indeed. Love them. Certainly stick around though, guys. Spot's going to do, again, more of these. Also, more collectible spots are heading your way as well. So there's definitely more on the way. Thanks for watching. See you next time.